this is a church, or rather a church building. We see these buildings throughout our communities. The word church, however, comes from a Greek word, which actually refers to a group of people, not a building. According to the Bible, the church is really a group of believers in Jesus Christ who meet together regularly to worship God, study His Word, and encourage and serve one another. Because we're used to thinking about buildings when we think of church, we often forget there is a church behind bars, groups of believers in Jesus Christ who are incarcerated. For over 30 years, the mission of Koinonia House Ministries has been to bridge the gap between the Christian inmate and the local church, helping the former inmate to relocate into the church, workplace, and society through biblical discipleship. We carry out our mission in a number of ways, through prayer conferences, ministries in prisons and jails, and coming alongside individuals and their families as they experience the difficulties that come with incarceration. We are grateful to First Congregational Church of Elgin for partnering with us and pleased to share a few highlights for the three specific areas of our work where we used your funds. Reentry summits, meet me at the gate, and radical timeout. For the reentry summits, you enabled our teams to travel to and participate in four reentry summits for the Illinois Department of Corrections at Hill, Illinois River and Dixon Correctional Centers. Our part in the summits is to help inmates prepare to face, in a positive way, the realities of returning to society. Approximately 300 men in total attended these four events. Koinonia House Ministries comes alongside volunteers from local churches to meet believers in Christ at the prison gate upon their release. By connecting at this important juncture, we help facilitate a connection with the church community, mentors, and encourage attendance at RTO. More about that later. In 2022, you helped Koinonia House provide assistance to six men released from prison, including one man who was met at the gate after 10 years of incarceration. In addition, we also conducted a formal Meet Me at the Gate training for a group from Southern Illinois interested in helping former inmates. Lastly, Radical Time Out, or RTO as it's affectionately called, is a weekly opportunity to experience the love of Christ in action regardless of color, class, culture, crisis, or crime. RTO is a safe and encouraging community of family members of the incarcerated, volunteers, former inmates, those anticipating entering a correctional facility, or anyone interested in having a front row seat to see and hear stories of God's redemption. Together we share an evening of fellowship and prayer, testimonies and Bible teaching, and once a month we share a meal. FCC enabled us to host RTO with an average weekly attendance in 2022 of 79, and this year, we have more. Program highlights included testimonies from former inmates, including someone incarcerated for 22 years. We signed Christmas cards for 100 inmates with connections to RTO, and we even enjoyed an evening of worship, dance, and music. Thank you, FCC friends, for enabling us to build bridges and restore hope for those impacted by incarceration.